so hello guys welcome back to the channel a lot of you guys are having queries when does the arcade and arcade facilitator program for cohort 2 starts so here is the video no need to worry about it i will cover everything from start from basics so first of all if you are new to this channel like the video and subscribe the channel now let's get started now as you know arcade program is running and will be adding on 27th of june till now if you haven't completed these games and want to participate and earn a place of basic tire swag you can complete it and for that i have already made a video you can check it out that means here is the video let me show you so yes this is the video you can watch it i will share the link in the description no need to worry about it but some of you want to start fresh that means you want to participate in the next cohort so when does the cohort 2 start so cohort 2 for the arcade program will be starting on first week of july and the arcade facilitator program the most requested request is that when does the arcade facilitator program starts so it will be starting on 4th of august and will be ending on 6th of october so here let me show you here is the arcade facilitator homepage, and the cohort to mention date is arcade august 4 2025 and till 6th of october so here are some important things you need to know that in arcade facilitator program basically we get bonus points for doing the labs here we do one thing let me show you the previous point structure so here we have milestone so we'll cover what are milestone and what are the difference between arcade and arcade facilitator milestone i will tell you no need to worry about it now here the arcade milestone is the milestone which gives us swags like this you can see arcade trooper arcade ranger these give swags that means if you have 40 points you will be getting these all goodies now here for the milestone 1 you get bonus point Facility, facilitator program gives us bonus points only there are no physical swags goodies etc but for the arcade program we get goodies so you need to understand that only now the main thing is that this program will be starting on 4th of august and the form will be released too so i will tell you how you'll fill the form and how we'll be able to get enrolled in it and if you want to know how you can become a facilitator and win exciting goodies which i'll be sharing when the prize mail will be out no need to worry about it so if you want how you can become a facilitator do comment down below i'll make a detailed video on it now here as you can see the milestone one is here by doing four -way games four trivia games and these 10 skill badges i will tell you what skill badges mean i will show you what are the difference between it two also so if you complete this and here they have added lafri courses so if you complete these all you'll be getting 15 bonus points sorry two bonus points and total 15 points similarly for the milestone 2 you can see we are getting eight bonus points these bonus points are given without any cost that means these are no cost you have to just do these and you'll be reached in this milestone will be getting the points like if you are in milestone 4 let's take this example only so suppose you are in the milestone 4 you have done 10 arcade games 8 trivia games and 44 school badges you'll be getting 25 bonus points that is very huge that means you can easily claim this basic milestone swag but if you already have 65 points you will be able to get the ranger milestone so i hope you got some confusion here so the skill badges here are skill badges we have to complete here skill badges have a list that means list of labs like as you see in arcade games let me show you one arcade game you will be able to understand it only easily so here you can see here is the arcade games and these are the list of labs. When you complete on this all, you'll be able to get the badge and you'll be able to earn the points. So this was the query. Now here, how we'll find the skill badges, where are the skill badge sheet, all things will be shared. As you have watched my videos already earlier, then you must have seen discover new skill badges in every description of a video. I'll show you. Let me show you wait a minute you can see these are the faqs for the arcade facilitator program you can watch it what are the major differences between the skill badges and completion badges lab limits etc lab free courses all are there now let me show you one important thing that how we'll find where are the skill badges okay so when you open any video any video suppose you open this video 
you can close it wait a minute scroll down you can see here here is the github that means for this lab if you want to get the tutorial you can watch it for pre-assessment badge here is the video that means if you complete one lab you will be getting this badge but for that you need to watch the video here now discover new skill badges which i was talking talking about so here you can see we have to complete 44 skill badges so how we'll find the skill badge you'll see here are the badge name that means when you click on this you will be redirected to that particular badge and for the playlist like you want to know where is the video guide for completing these labs you have to just click on the playlist sheet you can see these are the sheets of the lab basically these are the labs which are a part of this skill badge so let me show you this skill badge also so these are the complete guidelines you can complete it accordingly so these are the skill badges now one more important thing is that for arcade games also i have created a special sheet where you will be able to complete it with ease now once you have joined the arcade program there will be slightly change in the syllabus so the syllabus will be updated i think they will add or decrease some points like skill a may increase the lab free courses or skill badges you have to just check it like that only now the main thing is that for the arcade facilitator program you need to wait till the registration gets open now some of you are having queries like for accounts so can we use the account which we have used for cohort one so the answer is simply no you need to create a fresh gmail fresh cloud skills boost account and how we'll create it i have made a video for that also wait a minute you need to watch it i will share the link in the description no need to worry it's zero to hero so zero these are the skills post program so these are the basically playlist for all the skill badges and trivia so i will share the link in the video no need to worry i am unable to find it so let's continue with the video so you have to watch it and create again if you have already participated you already know how to create a cloud skills boost account and just join with so for that you have to create fresh account because you have already participated in the program and if you haven't participated you can just use your old account also now the old account here you can see skill badges are there but if you have already completed some skill badges then it will be difficult to reach the top milestone so i will recommend create a fresh account and start from zero now suppose if you have participated in the june june program that is a uh, solid july this means this cohort is ending in july 27th of june and the new cohort will start in july so if you have participated in the july cohort what you need to do is that you can continue with all the arcade games and leave skill badges for the last that means when the arcade facilitator program will start you have to start the doing the skill badges then only complete the skill badges you'll be able to get the more benefit of it so you can avoid it and one more confusion is that for two skill badges we are getting one point so make sure to follow this i hope there will be monsoon channels like we get one skill badge one point so i will make a video on it all updates will be covered no need to worry about it whatever update they will make all detailed video will be coming no need to worry about it uh, these are the arcade facilitator skill badges badges trivias this is my channel if you haven't subscribed it subscribe it and now here we are to also end now if you want to become an arcade facilitator you can comment down below i'll make a detailed video on it and then thanks for watching have a great day ahead